Yeah, I'm sitting here getting ready. We're going back to Eugene. Still plenty more to move, but we're, anyway. I'm sitting here looking out this window with the leaves and the, the road and the, the water. Just, it's, it's hard, hard to be disappointed here <laughs> about anything. And uh, so, but I'm, you know, obviously I keep thinking about the everything. The whole experience the other day over at the dock. And all the way I was, th I've been thinking all the way up until this point. And everything, really, absolutely everything. No one here knows about Bart and yeah. it's like I'm in an area where even telling the story isn't worth it for for what I experienced with with that with him and with don't want to talk about it actually I like the I like it's even though it's hard and rough and we have a tendency or I don't know but I think there's a human tendency to want pity and empathy yeah uh for our stories but I don't there's no option for that here that light here is weird but it's fine it's going with it there's no option for that and for me to keep my dignity at the same time so I'm surrounded by a, a circumstances that don't allow me to talk about it in an appropriate way. There's no one avoiding me over it. There's no one whispering things about it, as far as I know. They don't know him. They don't know, they didn't watch me raise him. They weren't around when it happened or the aftermath or what, how I've evolved since then. They just, I'm just new, and maybe they've heard about it, but I don't know. They just, then it's just a statistic. It's just a, oh, a thing about that, her and her family. If even anyone even knows or cares, I don't know. I haven't, people are always saying, oh, small towns gossip. I have not experienced that. I've not experienced it. I mean, the one lady, uh, she was a super gossip, but I didn't. I mean, who was she gossiping to? I don't know. Just random people, like people that were that I interact with in stores and stuff. But I'm just doing my business. I don't. I'm gonna sit there and gossip with them too. What would I gossip about? It is how beautiful it is out here. I don't know anyone to gossip about. So, um, I don't care if people gossip about me. I'm, I'm a, I'm a, I'm, I'm used to that. And I'm a big, I'm like a, I'm used to it. So, yeah, I keep thinking about, I keep trying to think, like, well, what was his perspective? <laughs> and, you know, if he didn't remember who I was, I don't know. It was just like, and I'm like coming up all excited, like, I'm, I don't know, he's, he, I don't know. I don't even know him, you know? But I feel like I do. And also, there's moments where I'm like, you know, step, tread lightly, like don't, you know, you really don't know what you're, look at this giant, these giant trucks outside. So fun. That one had two pilot cars. The utility trucks honk down when they pass the um, the water place, which I still need to get the water hooked up. <laughs> um, what were you talking about? Yeah, but I I don't I don't like I don't want to fight my instincts too too much on it on things like I just don't want to fight my instincts 
I respect them. If I have like this compelling need to do something or move forward on something, I'm I'm going to do it and trust that instinctively I know what I'm doing, even though I may not, it may not make sense on the surface. So that's, so that's how that's going with that. So I'm still going, I don't know. I still think the same way. <clears throat> I'm still obsessed, obviously. Which, I know, if you... <laughs> I don't care, okay? I don't care. For I had the experience, and that's how it worked out, and for, this is what's going on, okay? And I got, like, landed this amazing house in this amazing location that just keeps improving as I live here. The views, I mean, it's just... And just the experiences. We went and got pizza last night. It was so fun. And the I mean, the views. We watched pizza at the beach, in, parked in the car warm while the sun set and glowing and just people on the beach with bonfires and jumping around, having fun. It's, so, it's just amazing. And the people in Cannon Beach are having fun. And everyone's having fun. Including me. I'm going to keep going with this. I don't know what I'm going to do. Like, I don't know. I'm like, what the hell was this guy thinking? What was he thinking? I was thinking, I don't, it's, just, it's embarrassing, but it's, it's kind of like, I'm just going to. I know what I'm, I know better. I know my mind won't let me down. My it will figure it out. It will figure out what to do and how to handle this situation and the circumstances and the outcomes and the nuances. We'll figure it out. You know, like, I mean, I like my life. I'm having such a good time. You should see the boil happen. Okay. Let's get up. We gotta go. We're heading into Eugene today. Ugh, the cozy chair. The green dress is finally finished. We're gonna put these in the store. They're so cute. The color came out. The lighting here isn't respectable right now, so don't worry about that. The studio is so amazing. I have still a lot to deal with. I gotta do a French drain. I called the, I emailed the contractor. Look at these mountains back here. They're so pretty. Can you tell? I don't know if you can, but there's mountains there. I called the, but I might go see them, but I actually think I might be able to build the fence myself you know I think I can do it I want to build a little fence out there to surround my work area because the neighbors I don't want them to feel awkward I well I feel like it just kind of is a good way of like making it the area a little more secure like a formal sort of barrier from the street that's like yes this is a private area I mean obviously if no one comes up this driveway it's kind of cool but I do, I feel like they might feel awkward if I'm out there working and they're driving up and there's no separations of our driveway. It just looks like this one general area. And so if I just put a little fence thing that will give more of a barrier and then they, it's like a separation of space. Nothing obnoxious. It's just a modest little like five foot loose, pal loose board fence that kind of creates a perimeter. And I think that's a good idea. And then I'm going to probably take down two of the walls, but not fully, just partially. And then also put ex extended, um, like, rain roof stuff, roof clear thing, like a clear thing. And extend it out past the wall parts that I'm taking down. And then... Because that already needs some help. Like, it just needs help. I'm going to power wash, too, eventually. And I already said my prayers about being on the ladder. So I'm safe. I'm climbing the ladder. And the la it will be, I will be very safe and secure on the ladder going up and down. And I will stay on the ladder as intended. So that's what's happening with that. And, the, yeah, so I'm, t I'm just hanging out with you guys. Like, it's I'm in pajamas right now, you know, obviously chilling I'm getting ready to go got my briefcase got my order there's no I don't know if there's garbage service here I'm not getting the impression that there is in this in this particular there's no 
post, there's no mail here, which Amazon doesn't seem to understand, but I have to, now I have to figure out, because some of their packages they send, USPS even, and USPS doesn't deliver here, but UPS does, so that's weird, but um, I ordered all this stuff from Amazon, and they broke it up into like three different ma mail carriers, and one is USPS, and I'm like, they, it just says undeliverable, but they kept the money, so I don't, but they're not, they're going to eventually refund me, because they're not delivering it, but I've had that happen before, where I ordered these crab traps, you know, when I first got into crabbing with Isaiah years ago, and they kept my money, and they never deliver it, and it was like a hundred bucks, and this is like a hundred dollars in delivery, and I'm like, just don't keep, they won't keep the money, they're refunding the money, or they're returning, they're going to figure it out, I will call, I'll figure it out, how to get them to like, don't send it USPS, <sighs> weird little things like that, but it's fine, I kind of like it, it's cool, like, it just makes this little house interesting that way, it's such a cove up in here. It's so cool. And that place in Crossway is definitely an Airbnb. Um, but there's no garbage either, so I have to haul the garbage out. So that's whatever. I've lived in a cabin before where that these were all the cases. And in Fall Creek. And there's so, so much reminiscent of that here too. <sighs> yeah, the cat hates this floor. It's cold. It's like floor whatever you call it i don't know what that new type of flooring is but it'll, it'll do for now what were you talking about yeah guys i don't <laughs> as long as a guy doesn't think that i'm like trying to let like i'm like some kind of a i don't know I don't know. I want to say it was embarrassing, but I'm not sure what is. Go I don't. Maybe I don't. Who, who cares at this point in life? Like, <sighs> yeah. <laughs> so it's just fucking <laughs> crazy. Okay, well that's it. Okay, I'm gonna. Uh, I'm uploading this video. It's a fantastic video. This is an amazing video. It's fantastic. I'm sharing. We're and I'm sharing my life with you. And you're it's helping you. And you are having a great time watching my video. And I appreciate that. And thank you for the thumbs ups. You guys, you thumb uppers, you consistent thumb uppers. I appreciate that of you. And we will keep going on. Look at the inventory. Isn't that pretty? This lighting is serving it in no way. I need these are drying. These are dresses. Cute. Yeah, it's been a quiet month, guys. I have not been, uh, I, I cut off my ads again. All the ads are off and no e-letters. Like, it's just been, even, <laughs> just, it's just, I'm moving. Like, I'm in the, I'm, oh, wait, I gotta send an, I gotta, I have packages to send. And, but I said, I figure, okay, so this month is just gonna be that way. Maybe even the whole season, guys. It just might be me and YouTube and uploading the saga of my life and the pursuit of <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> what is this man? This guy is just like, <laughs> who are you? What are you? I think he's worried I'm like some crazy Portland lady. And I'm just like, oh, fuck. I just need to back off in a huge way like no I'm not actually but I I could see that fuck I, like, I, I am not I'm not that so I don't know but okay so that's 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 traumatizing but yeah I can't I, I am in an area where I have to start fresh Maybe that was the intention all along, like super fresh, you know, with my, with all the traumas in life and stuff. There's just no speaking about it. And it is hard. Let me tell you, that is hard, but it, it's, they already know the other way. So it, it's, 
it might as well be difficult anyway. Like starting over and with no no one having any concept of what our lives experienced, our family experienced. Like I said, I uh, I almost prefer it because it's a forced stoicism. And you have you you even if I don't like it, it is the way it is. So deal, you know, I'm dealing with it. It was kind of like that actual night trying to deal with the cops. God, they were so they were such ruthless just animals of disgust. They're just disgusting stupid people disgusting the way they were treating me and the situation and the things they said and they didn't they were so even skeptical of the way I was like so deadpan about everything so plain faced and to the point and you know just but what was I gonna do what was I gonna do who are they to judge the situation this they did they might as well have just handed me a fucking voter's pamphlet and voted for their fucking blue, blue idiot puppet. They're all puppets anyway, but like, it just was like so agenda and just so disgusting. And I had to deal with it. I had to go through it. I had to, I had to just do it. Really the worst thing that anyone could ever imagine. And there's really no other choice. So I had to do it. Look at the leaves in the background. That's pretty. Those mirrors are cool too. So there's my pajamas. <laughs> yeah, you see, I don't really like talking about that too much. What's the point? So I like the new life, you know? Oh, by the way, this window does open. Isn't that cool? Even with its mess ups and stuff, you know, like me trying to fucking approach this man that he's like, he's just like, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so these are cute. They came out so good. I have to ship this now. I'm going to do that, and then we're heading out, and then I'll upload this later. Yeah, guys. This house is able to make batiks. So that's my plan. I That's my actual plan, is to make batiks until my inventory is good at a good point again, and then start marketing. I'm going to keep uploading these videos. It's the only thing that's holding me Hold them, keep them the consistency going. I did go back over there. I went back over there to see him again, but he wasn't there. <laughs> Not only do I think the guy thinks I'm crazy, but I think everyone else thinks I'm crazy too. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care, okay? I listen to me. I listen to me, all right? And I have it in me. I know the warning flags. I know what I'm, I don't, I trust. I trust what I'm doing. And I'm, that's who I listen to. My instincts or the voice. I pray, okay? And then I get, I, I, I get a conclusion. So I think that is coming from God. I think God just guides me quietly. And if I just stay quiet and give it time, I, I, I can find things. I can figure things out. So that's what's up. Okay. I haven't t gotten a message that says, oh, bad red, red flag. You know, I haven't gotten that. I get that early when I meet someone. This was just a debacle, okay? It wasn't a red flag. Yet, okay, it won't be. There's no red flag. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. I'll be dressed, I'll be, we'll be, we'll be having a, we'll be fancy and fun, okay?
We'll get back to it. Well, I'm going to show you how it, the setup is going. But I still need to finish. I'm going to put a French drain out here and, and the walls and the fence and all of those things. And lighting. Ooh, we're going to fix the lighting up too. We need to get a cat door. I already took down the screen door. So that's helping her out a lot. That was intense, but we did it. And so she's she's starting to, I think she's starting to figure out the outside game plan. Now, because uh, I have less mess in the house. Thank God. Oh, that, was, it just, I, that was just like wearing on me. That was just taxing. I can't, I can't, I can't handle that kind of stuff. Look at these came out so good. Okay, thanks for watching. Oh, wait, one more thing. One more thing. Now, we'll... Yeah, we'll tell you in the next video. Okay, we'll... Okay, bye.